Three suspects in North Carolina were arrested and charged on Monday in connection with an alleged kidnapping and abuse of a victim. Madison County Sheriff Buddy Harwood described the crime as a horrific incident. He said an investigation was launched after a resident reported that an unidentified person showed up at their home saying they had been kidnapped. Deputies then responded to the area and discovered the victim with numerous lacerations to the face, body, and arms. Deputies also noticed that the victim had multiple cross symbols carved onto their face and body. The victim was transported to a hospital for medical treatment. Harwood said deputies probed the area and located the residence of the alleged kidnapping. The sheriff's office executed a search warrant and determined that the suspects Patrick Banks, James Angel, and Nicole Sawyer had forcibly imprisoned the victim in the basement of the home by tying their hands and feet to a chair with barbed wire. The suspects had also allegedly tied the victim's chest to a structural beam and taped their mouth shut. Patrick Banks, James Angel, and Nicole Sawyer were arrested and charged after allegedly kidnapping and torturing a victim in their basement. Patrick Banks, James Angel, and Nicole Sawyer were arrested and charged after allegedly kidnapping and torturing a victim in their basement. Madison County Sheriff's Office North Carolina man allegedly kidnapped woman, talked cannibalism, and threatened to kill her for the thrill. The sheriff's office concluded that the victim had been punched and kicked in the head, struck multiple times in the head by firearms and a crowbar and sliced by knives, which resulted in multiple lacerations to the victim's face and hands. The suspects had forcibly imprisoned the victim in the basement of the home by tying their hands and feet to a chair with barbed wire. The suspects had forcibly imprisoned the victim in the basement of the home by tying their hands and feet to a chair with barbed wire. Madison County Sheriff's Office Banks was charged with assault with a deadly weapon inflicting serious bodily injury with intent to kill, first-degree kidnapping, possession of a weapon of mass destruction and possession of a firearm by a convicted felon. Banks was already wanted for a parole violation and had a felony warrant for his arrest for cutting off a probation electronic monitoring device. Michigan man pleads guilty after murdering, eating testicles of other man met on dating app. The victim had been punched and kicked in the head, struck multiple times in the head by firearms and a crowbar and sliced by knives. The victim had been punched and kicked in the head, struck multiple times in the head by firearms and a crowbar and sliced by knives. Angel was charged with assault with a deadly weapon inflicting serious bodily injury with intent to kill, first-degree kidnapping, and possession of a weapon of mass destruction. Angel also had a warrant for larceny and possession of marijuana from another county. Sawyer was charged with assault with a deadly weapon inflicting serious bodily injury with intent to kill, first-degree kidnapping, and possession of a weapon of mass destruction.